Welcome back to On The Promenade, and we have an unboxing, a Loot Crate unboxing for December 2016. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and, and get into it. So this month, um, I think the theme is Revolutions, and it has, again, to do with uh, a couple of different products that have to do with that uh, theme. Again, Revolution is, I think, a theme for this month. So let's go ahead and get into this unboxing and see what we have. So we got a bit of a design here. Looks like very much a renaissance, kind of maybe Baroque, uh, old architecture. And as usual, the Loot Crate boxes will form something. So um, here we go. So first up, we have the Loot Crate pin. And of course, you can see that is the Assassin's Creed crest. Uh, so that's a very cool pin. I like the way it's made. It's made pretty nicely. Um, all the pins are usually great, and this one looks very cool. It has that um, Assassin's Creed uh, sigil right there. So that is nice. So again, uh, December 2016. And yes, it is uh, Revolution is the theme again this month. So next up after that, we have the uh, Firefly Independence patch. Um, if you haven't seen Firefly, you definitely have to see it. It's a basically a space western. Um, it's set in the future in another galaxy. Uh, something has happened to Earth, and um, so uh, mankind, all the humans, leave and go to another galaxy, and then um, stuff goes from there. Uh, you have uh, the main uh, lead, Captain Malcolm Reynolds, kind of sets off with his own ship, the Serenity, a Firefly class. But anyways, before that, he was a soldier, and this was the patch of um, the Independence. Um, uh, so we have a Independence patch, and it's a very nice patch. It looks like it has uh, stuff on the back so it can, I guess, iron on. Um, or you can stitch it on as well. It's pretty heavily made. It's nice. Um, so yeah, got a nice little Firefly patch. That looks great. Looks like it's a Loot Crate exclusive. Very, very nice. Uh, next up, we're going to do the t-shirt and let's see what that's about. Okay, so for the t-shirt, this is from uh, the show Mr. Robot. Unfortunately, I have not seen a show. Uh, there's so much good TV out now that um, I'm still missing this one. But this is, I guess, the, um, the, the insignia from Mr. Robot. Looks pretty cool. Um, looks like St. F Society. Uh, has this little mask kind of character. It looks like it's a like a stencil kind of idea that is sprayed on. Looks pretty cool. So, yeah. This is the t-shirt again. Uh, for this month for Revolution, and this is from Mr. Robot. So let's go ahead and get on to our next item and see what we have. So next up, we have this Assassin's Creed Aguilar uh, crouching uh, vinyl figure. So let's see. So it looks like you have a couple of different uh, figures. There's Aguilar, Maria, um, Ojeda, I think that's how you pronounce it, and Callum Lynch, who is a uh, Aguilar's present day um descendant so this is from the assassin's creed the movie uh not related to the game well it's related to the games but no none of these characters appeared in the games um and it looks like the difference between the characters is that this is a crouching character so i guess that's what makes it the exclusive it says it is a loot crate exclusive so let's see what that looks like outside of the box so here we go here is the uh pops figure that we have the uh vinyl pops I'm usually not the biggest fan of these. I mean, they're cool, just n not into them as much. Um, but it does look cool, and I like that it is a Loot Crate exclusive. I do find that if it's not uh, pointed with his head going in this direction, uh, that it gets a little lopsided if you uh, have it going over to the right a little bit too much. So here he is crouching. Um, it looks pretty cool. It looks like he's crouching over a building, and you can see that his... Um, Hidden Blade is out. It looks like he's about to make a kill like the Assassin's Creed characters. Uh, so that looks very cool. And I guess the, again, what makes him a, um, exclusive uh, versus the other version is that he is in this uh, crouching stance. So, like I said, I'm not usually into the pops, but this is pretty cool. Um, I do like Assassin's Creed. It's one of my favorite games. So this looks pretty nice. So let's get on and see what we have 
up next. So let's just move this over. There we go. Um, so this month we do have this little uh, coupon from Sideshow Collectibles as well. And it relates to the book that we have here. So let's go ahead and look at that and see what that's about. So here's a book. It's a nice like art book, kind of a photography book uh, called Figure Fantasy. And it's basically and just... Um, Oh, it looks like it has a forward by Simon Pegg. That's pretty cool. So it's um, somebody taking, uh, I guess it's the, oh, and afterwards by Kevin Smith. Um, I guess it's Daniel Picard. Yeah, the photography of Daniel Picard. So it's him setting up uh, these figures that he has. I think they're all sideshow uh, collectible figures, but he uh, sets them up and takes, you know, really cool pictures of them and makes a scene. So here we got like Batman kind of kicking down the door, but it's the Batman figure. We got a uh, Simon Pegg figure kind of standing with a, it looks like a Jason mask. Maybe he beat down Jason and took the mask. And I guess this is uh, Daniel Picard and his uh, figures uh, in there kind of making it look like he's he standing next to him. So a Photoshop manipulation. So it's pretty cool. It's got some really uh, cool pieces in here. Um, I don't know if this is... Is this a Loot Crate exclusive? I don't know if it is. Oh, yeah, it does say that it is a Loot Crate exclusive. So usually with these art books, um, when they are exclusive like this, it's just that they have a different cover. It might have some extra maybe pages or something in there. But anyways, it looks pretty cool. Got a, oh, a Star Wars uh, Snow Trooper. Looks like it's cleaning off his car. Uh, Cobra Trooper. This dog. So this is pretty cool. It's got some really cool stuff with it. <laughs> Superman is Clark Kent. <laughs> Bruce Wayne is Batman. So really uh, cool stuff that he's done. R really great photographer and uh, photo manipulator as well. <laughs> so really great book that we have. And let's see. Last but not least, we of course have the uh, Loot Crate booklet. And again, this does deal with the theme revolution. So it just goes into everything that we have uh, this month. Uh, I was just talking about Assassin's Creed. Here's some more Assassin's Creed. Here's the patch. And it shows, you know, has articles and shows um, different stuff for this month. So Firefly. So the History. box kind of transforms into this old kind of Renaissance kind of uh, building, like a church. Oh, um, in so it has like some Renaissance uh, architecture that goes along with our Aguilar character. So he just kind of sits on the top like so like he is about to make a kill um and do the leap and leap down and take out a character because again he does have his little blade out so that is what the box forms for this month okay uh so let's also go ahead and do a recap of what we have um what we've gotten this month and go okay so here we go here's everything that we got for the month a little recap of everything so of course we always get the loot crate book right here um about revolutions we got the loot crate pin right over here the assassin's creed pin um again going along with the theme revolution uh we got the firefly independent patch there we go second so we got a firefly independent patch we have this book uh the figure fantasy book and we have the aguilar uh pops figure and we have the mr robot t-shirt in the back so this is what we have received this month for um december 2016 the loot crate unboxing here on on the promenade again come back uh, next month we'll be doing another loot crate unboxing and check out some of our other videos uh we do i i do um some uh art book reviews um i was doing some cg um how to uh videos as well i'll be getting back to those uh hopefully starting next month 
Um, and then we'll have different random stuff here and there. So check out some of the other videos that we have down below. And uh, keep an eye open for other stuff here that I do here on, on the promenade. And again, come back next month for our next Loot Crate unboxing. Again, this has been the Loot Crate unboxing for December 2016. And again, with a theme of revolution. Thanks again for stopping by and viewing on the promenade.